Hello, peeps, and welcome back to another episode of Crashland. So I've been out here grinding turtles, trying to get us a baby turtle, and it's not going well. Um, and I did some other grinding off camera as well. Uh, I ended up starting a quest that I had been looking for to get the bacon weed pots. So let's just run home really fast, and I'll show you uh, what I've been working on. All right, as you can see, I expanded the house here. Uh, we have bacon weed pots now. I do have to finish that quest, um, but thankfully we did get it started. Um, so we have all the, like, we're not gonna have to be quite so concerned about collecting bacon weed uh, when we're out and about, out to the boot, cause we're gonna get a fair amount from here. And as you can see, if you look at my first slot, um, I turned a bunch of bacon weed into this potion that I unlocked. It's a health potion that just does better. Um, there isn't one that you can turn the shrooms into yet. The, um, these, these things, what are those called? The omelet shrooms or whatever. Um, so anyways, I'm going to come and collect these really fast. Uh, I also got enough fertile dirt to uh, finish filling in our garden. Now we could always expand it out that way, but the problem is, is we don't get enough seeds. I'm not gonna worry about doing that on camera. I'll collect those later. We have more than enough. I am gonna craft a little bit more fertile dirt because one of our quests require that we have one. And I wanna do one quick thing. So we're gonna take that floor away. I'm gonna throw a fertile dirt there. And then we're going to plant a flower of Marla. And that's where we'll have the flower of Marla. We could do it in here too. I can't remember what the flower of Marla actually does, but we'll just throw it there for now. Oh, and we forgot to get our fertile dirt. Okay, so quests. I want to accomplish some quests today. Um, first, we, we could get this done. Um, I can't remember how much they needed. Eight. We need eight. And we only have two log seed trees. So actually, we will have to go uh, kill some log seeds. Um, what I'm going to do though, oops. Um, also, notice I crafted the blowpipe. Um, I just did it off camera so I could get some more work done. Some more grinding. Because I was grinding. Um, I was grinding creatures too. Alright, the rest we'll do by hand. So we got 10 sawgrass seed. I don't know how many logs we got. And these don't, you have to do these by hand or you have to get the better harvest bomb, which I didn't want to waste resources on. And I apologize if I sound a little tired. Um, that's because I am. Oh, we only have four. Okay. Well, let's just plant what we've got here. I'm saving those other bacon weed pan plants. Pants. Um, okay, so let's head over to where we need to go. I'm always gonna still be picking up the fertile dirt, or the dirt. We have to make it fertile dirt. Fertile dirter. And I'm still, I mean, if there's a bacon weed on our path, we might as well pick it up. All right, so we need to go. So this is where I started a new quest in Uggie's Meadow. Um, I've been looking for this off camera and I just went ahead and started it so I could get the bacon weed growing so that I could help us in our other quest. But they wanted five potted bacon weeds. There we go. Nicest walking flower I ever met, Purpley. These ought to come arned down. Uh, that one pit came when it was dark, stomped me in my pappy blind. Excuse me? He died, splished to the ground like a water in bloom. What, who died? My pappy, ain't you listening? You find that creature, the one called Nightwaka. And you spoosh him. You spoosh him dead. Nightwaka. Waka. I like that. Um, where we can find this Nightwaka. 
He could be anywhere by now, roaming around the savannah. Find him wherever he is and sploosh him. Okay, well, we're just going to uh, happily collect these that we just brought to them because I want all the bacon weed. Um, okay, so now we gotta keep an eye out for Nightwalker. We also need to be collecting log trees, which I can't find any. We came so close to them. It's ridiculous. Let's also get some of these. Just as we're going, I'm I'm a little low on flat stone. I will be grinding more off camera. Um, just to try to make the, the game a little bit more interesting for you guys. So we're actually accomplishing things on camera. There are some things that I just can't pass up though, like this. One shot resource harvesting. Oh, perfect. Now would be a really good time to come on to a bunch of these. Don't do that, that's rude. Rude Hugo Dugo. Although I suppose Hugo Dugo does not stand for the nicest thing in the world. Anyway, okay, so we have seven seeds. We need 10, right? Eight. I think we need eight. All right, I think we got as many as we need. I'm just gonna get a couple more while we've got the one shot harvesting. I have noticed that creatures tend to ignore us the more powerful we get. Uh, I could be wrong, but it used to seem like these guys would have attacked us a lot sooner than they do now. Only a little bit more of the one shot re uh, harvesting left. Don't attack him. Attack that. Yeah, there we got a little in their face. Okay, so that's gone. Let's get out of combat and then we'll go to where we need to go. All right, um, Paolo Paul. Oh, we're not that far. Well, we might as well warp. All right. This is who it was that wanted it, right? I guess I should double check our quests. Durned, yep. Um, okay. Oh wait, I forgot to check. Eight, yep. So we gotta put down the fertile dirtle. Oh no. No, we're not one short. We put down too many. Good. I was gonna be really sad because I'm like pretty sure. Okay, can we finish the quest or do we have to wait for them to grow? Marla is the greatest of roots. Okay, so I think we have to wait for them to be fully grown. So let's go work on another quest. What other quest? Um, out of retirement. Let's go ahead and go get these supplies because it's right here. And we're fairly close to that anyways. And it'll probably be an easy one to knock out. And I suppose we should just knock out some of the easier ones while we can. So we gotta go up and a little to the left through here. I um, have been doing a little bit of fishing. I need to do some more fishing off camera. I do know that. Oh, these, we need these. Cause I haven't unlocked, I don't know if there's a recipe to grow those, but if there is, I haven't unlocked it yet. Those aren't as important cause we can grow those. So we do have to collect these when we're out about cause I haven't found a lot of them. And I think that we are going to need them. Also, we're working on this, but we need to, oops, tame a tartel, um, which is really just gonna require me running around and killing turtles until, uh, until we get one. But I think that we can wait on that a little bit because, let's check the map. Um, 
I could uh, I could level up a little bit more or like gear up. I want to gear up a little bit more before we do. I can I can win with them now, but it's a little bit of a process, and it requires me using a lot of um, health stuff, healing uh, supplies, which we have. I mean, look at how many things we have, but still. Okay, so we are where we need to be. Let's super fast. Oh, I haven't had breakfast yet this morning, and I just realized that. Just realized. I don't have anything good to, to eat for breakfast. Yeah, oops. Yeah, what do we get? Fishing bonus. Oh, not something we really need right now. Oh, here's the supplies, I'm guessing. Oh, lovely. Oh, this is just brilliant. All right, let's take care of some of these really easy ones to kill. Um, first thing I'm going to do is switch that back out for um, this. Oh, no, wrong one. Okay. Equip that. Equip that. I think I need more equip slots. Let's equip... The speed potion. We can't use the speed potion. Oh. And then we'll switch it out for that. Oh, crap. It's a good thing I always have stuff on me. Oh crap, we should have taken care of those guys. Alright, got him. Got that supply. Glutterflies aren't too hard, so we'll take this one out next. Oh, I'm gonna die. Crap. Unfortunately, the glutterfly in a confined space is a little bit harder. Um, no worries, no worries, we will. So I don't think the speed potion really did anything. Of course, there's not a closer thing. Of course not. So we have to go all the way back up there. Dude, I don't want to, I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to talk to you. Just keep heading. Just keep heading back up there. I, oh my gosh, you can tell that I'm not talking as animatedly as I normally do. And I apologize for that. Um, that's what I get for oversleeping. I, I decided to let myself sleep in today. And I, I definitely think that I needed some extra sleep. But I might have overdone it a little bit. Okay, let's double check where we're at. Okay, perfect. Look at that, maybe we'll get a good bonus over here. Time warp, that would be a lot more useful if it were closer to the thing. To that thing. All right. So we gotta make a little bit of smarter decisions this time around. A little bit smarter. Oh, I'm definitely going to have to take a break after this episode to eat. I really saw how hungry I was. Okay, it would be better if we could draw this guy out. Are you coming? In an area we can dodge a little bit more? Or we just let, we'll just let Littlefoot do. Littlefoot can do their thing. Oh, oh. I don't want to. I don't want to engage these guys. <sighs> okay. So what I'm gonna do? Oh crap! Stop it! Being annoying. Now I'm not. Okay. 
Okay, I'm not in combat anymore. There. So now I have a way to escape and not take damage. I'm just playing it a little cautious. Crap! I ran, I ran away. It's really annoying. It is really annoying. I guess let's go to Grandmammy's and go up. I thought this would be a little bit easier than it's turning out to be. More bacon weed. We'll take it. As we walk up, I'm just going to collect some more sun shrooms. That's what they're called. Because they're sunny side up. Haha, <laughs> get it? Get it? It's hilarious. Okay. Straight up. I don't know what these are used for. I don't think we've used them yet. But I always grab them. Oh, crap. Oh, I forget, it's already selected. Some of the mechanics in this game are a little, like... Like, the fighting is a little difficult for me because it's hard to sometimes click on the correct target. And it automates a couple things that I really wish it wouldn't. Oops. Oops, whoa. Oh, here we go. I can go through here. I can go through here. Ooh, a thing. Let's go touch... Oh, no, it's not the thing that I thought it was. Okay, yep, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't go that close. Get him. Get him, little foot. It's just that little foot. Now, yeah, if I can drag him out where it's more of an open area, I've never really had a huge problem killing these guys. There you go. Oh, crap. Let's eat, eat one of those. Let's let little foot do sing for a minute while I recover. Yay! What's that? Oh, we got a glitter fly egg, guys! We got a glitter fly egg! Now we need a tortilla egg. Okay. Come here, little foot. Get off there. Hi, bud. I'll use this hat, guys. Okay, so we don't need that anymore. Now we just have to kill this one. What if we also got the egg over here? That would make life amazing! Okay, do we need to do any healing? I think we're okay. I'm just gonna, we're just gonna do this. We're just gonna wait a minute. Cause this is probably the one I'm gonna have the, the hardest time dealing with. So I wanna, I wanna let the run, timer run out just a little bit. 18 seconds. Great, run. We're just gonna let Littlefoot do his thing. He's making it really easy on us. Like, he's just gonna chase us down. Okay. Let him come to us. Right. I, I do the, the hit and dodge strategy, strategy and let Lilfa do majority of the damage. Seems to work the most effectively. Nice. Good job, Littlefoot. No, no egg, unfortunately. 
We did get the other supply crate. So I'm going to pick up the floors here. Can I pick up? Oh, no, I can't. No, I can't. Dang it. Okay. So I picked up the floors. Now we can go back to Grandmammy's. And then, we could wrap up this quest. Look at the progress we're making. Two quests wrapped up. That'll make them hurt. Now where can I, we get that dish? Right, well, attention. I'm hearing whispers that a small tendrum village is being overrun by Tartas. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Surely Hugo Dugo is behind it, Grandmammy. Happens to be uh, the village run by a tendrum called Barnabas. Barnabas, fate is strong, Thari. Barnabas might know where you can get your dish. Indeed, Barnabas' engineering skills aren't matched anywhere on the savannah. He might be the only one with the knowledge you seek. Quit yammering then and show us where the village is. Yes, sir. Get to the Barna pool and take out all the tartels you can find and then talk to Barnabas. This is actually perfect. Uh, this is exactly what we need to be doing. However, we need to go home. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Let's go home first, and let's see if we can do any upgrading. And look at this. We should make the glitter fly egg thing too. For sure. So we've got some housekeeping stuff we can do. So we'll probably finish that, work on that quest some more next time. This is good. We'll collect these about twice an episode, um, which will be perfect because that's getting 10, I believe. Yeah, 10 of these every episode, 10 of each of these every episode, which we're probably not quite using 10 episodes. So we should always be staying ahead in theory. No, we should be get 20 of these an episode. Yeah, we definitely should be staying ahead. So that's good. What does that do? That doesn't do anything. Okay. No, we need to build a glutterfly. That's not where you build it. Glutterfly nest. Ooh, we should build a stone bed. Let's build that. Let's build some fun stuff. Tenacity. Huh, <laughs> we have enough to build that. Um. Stone creature bed. Sure. Glutter net. Glutter flies go crazy. This kind of crap. It begins your glutter fly to a powerful size. So we're not. Oh, there we go. Glutter fly incubator. Alright. And throw some of this stuff down. And then to get more powerful armor, we need to. We need to make some more of that. We can make that here. So let's just build all of it. I think those are the flowers that I was talking about. Let's keep six of them so that I don't um so I don't overdo it. Wait. No, we already built those. What we need, yeah, what we need we can only get from a turtle. Okay. Oh, I'm so excited, guys. So let's throw down Glutterfly. Nope. And then we can put that bed there, and then we'll put our bed there. Actually, let's put that next to our bed. Super cute. Okay, uh, five minutes, so we might as well just hang out here, um, and keep working on our armor. Oh, look at this, so we can, can, we can make it all. Let's build that. Let's build those. Oh, we need that. We definitely need that. Um, let's build that. Oh, I'm so excited. So excited. Let's go ahead and go harvest this stuff up while we wait. Mm. 
This will be actually a great place to end the episode. I just want to pull that stuff out. We'll get the rest of that later. I'm not really too worried about it. All right, let's see what. Let's see how we done. Let's see how we done did. Oh, not a very good one. Squash of squash of hustling, but it does have better fire resist, which is actually what we need. Let's see how we do with this one. Ooh, it's green at least. Ooh, there's a turbo chance and poison resist. Um, let's take it. Why not? Yay! The squeeba up and it's green. Berserk chance, nice. And it is much better. So we're gonna equip that one one more. Five seconds. I know the video is going a little bit long. Well, I've been doing these 30 minutes anyways. I suppose it's not that big of a deal. Health, toughness, electric resist. Uh, we don't have the freeze chance, but I'm still going to take that one. Look at us. Look at us with our awesome armor. Oh, three more minutes. Three more minutes. What should we do for three minutes? There's really not much to do, so I think we're going to let that hatch in the uh, next episode. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you haven't yet, go ahead and, go ahead and subscribe, and I will see you next time on Crashlands. Bye-bye!